Good morning, everyone. How are you? Let's start our English lesson. What's today? Yes, today is Tuesday. Now let's see what's on for today. We want to revise grammar, letters, and writing. Let's revise grammar. Look at the picture. Can you describe the man by using he or she and his job? Yes, he is a fireman. He is a fireman. Let's see the second one. Look at the man. Can you describe him by using the correct pronoun? Excellent. He is a teacher. He is a teacher. Okay, what about this one? Do we say he or she for her? Excellent. So, she is a doctor. She is a doctor. Now, let's see the next one. We have a woman. So, she is a housewife. She is a housewife. She is a housewife. Now, let's see this man. With I want to ask about him. Is he a pilot? Is he a pilot? Let's answer the question. So, we answer the question by saying, Yes, he is. So, the man is a pilot. So, we answer with a yes. Then we put a comma. We have he in the question, so we put he in the answer, and we have started the question with is, so we in the question with is. So the right answer is yes, he is. Yes, he is. Now let's see this pupil. Is he a policeman? Is he a policeman? Please give me a full answer. Excellent. No. He isn't. No, he isn't. No, he isn't. Now, is she a zookeeper? Is she a zookeeper? So the right answer is yes, she is. Yes, she is. Yes, she is. Now, look at this woman. Is she a zookeeper? Yes, what is the answer? Excellent. So, no, she isn't. No, she isn't. No, she isn't. Now, let's order. We want to order these words. A pilot, he is. Here we have a question. So, we start the question with is. Excellent. So, what is the, the second word? He, a pilot. Well done. So we have, is he a pilot? We have, is he? Yes. How can we order the answer? So we start the answer with, yes, he is. Well done. So we have the answer, yes, he is. Look at this question, she is a teacher. Can you reorder the words? So, we start with is she a teacher? Is she a teacher? Excellent. Now, let's reorder the answer. We have isn't she no? Yes! So, we have no she isn't. No, she isn't. Excellent. Now, let's revise the letters. First of all, get your whiteboard to write some letters. Look at the picture. Can you guess what is the missing letter? Is it ma or na or wa? Here, we have a picture for a mom. So, the missing letter is ma. 
Excellent. So we have the word mom. 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 Let's see the second one. What is the missing letter? Is it ma, na, or wa? Well done. So the missing letter is na and the word is nurse. 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 Excellent. Let's see the third one. What is the missing letter? Yes, it's O and the word is orange. 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 Excellent. What about this one? Yes, so the missing letter is pa and the word is ben. 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 Look at this one. Can you remember it? What is the missing letter? Yes, it's number two. E and the word is ink. Ink, ink. Let's move to this one. Where is the right letter for it? Excellent. So it's number one, and the word is jam, jam, jam. Okay, here we have a picture for a kite. So the missing letter is. Yes, number three, and it's ka, and the word is kite, kite, kite. Excellent. And here the last one for today is, yes, it's a lion, and the missing letter is L, la, la, lion, la, la, lion. Excellent, and well done. Now, let's revise writing. We have studied about the capital letter at the beginning of the sentences and the full stop at the end of them. So we have here, yes, she is. We want to circle the capital letter and the full stop. So the capital letter is ya and the full stop is here. So we have capital letter at the beginning of the sentence and full stop at the end of it. Okay, let's see the second one. She's a teacher. Where is the capital letter? Yes, sa is the capital letter and here we have the full stop. Let's move now, correct the mistake. Look, he's a pilot. We have two mistakes. Where are they? Can you guess? Yes, we should write his with a capital ha, capital ha, and we should put a full stop at the end of the sentence. So the right sentence is this one. He is a pilot with capital ha and a full stop at the end of the sentence. Now let's see this one. This is my mom this is my mom we have two mistakes yes we have t small and we didn't put a full stop so the right one is this one this is my mom with a capital t and a full stop at the end of this sentence he's a doctor he is a doctor. Where are the mistakes? Yes. Small ha. Huh? And we don't have a full stop. So the right answer is he is a doctor with capital ha huh? and a full stop at the end of the sentence. Excellent. Now open your workbook page number 35 please. We want to answer the first question. Write the sentences with capital letters and full stops. Number one, this is my grandpa. So we write it with a capital ta and a full stop at the end of the sentence. 
Let's see number two. He is a postman. So, we should write it with capital ha and a full stop at the end of the sentence. So, we have he is a postman. Let's see number three. This is my brother. So, we circle small ta because we want to write it with a capital letter. So, this is my brother with capital ta and a full stop at the end of the sentence. Number four. These are my hands. These are my hands. So, we put a circle around the small ta and we write it with a capital ta. These are my hands and a full stop at the end of the sentence. Let's see the last one. I am a pupil. I am a pupil. So, circle the E and write it with capital E because it's at the beginning of the sentence and put a full stop at the end of the sentence. So, we have I am a pupil. Excellent. We're done with our lesson for today. Your homework is to answer the copy book page number 32. Thank you for your attending and goodbye.